Yo, YouTube, what's going on? Welcome to another video to the channel, y'all boys. And today we're going to go ahead and review Mr. 89 Rated Neymar. Guys, coming around 579,000 coins on the market, 540 on the PC. Um, in today's video, we will be trying him out with the Hawk chemistry style. As you guys can see, he's going to be having a plus 4 pace, plus 5 shooting, and a plus 4 physicality. Um, this Neymar, compared to last year Neymar, he does have a little bit of a pace downgrade. You know, a lot of people were kind of complaining about that. I mean, to be fair, EA pace downgraded everybody. So there's not really much you can do about that. But in game, we're going to be playing a 4-3-1-2. And Neymar is going to be playing as our left striker. So we want to see with Neymar if, obviously, for the most part, I assume he's still going to be very meta. But we want to see if that pace downgrade does hinder him a little bit from being him like that top five or that top two gold card that he is every year. Obviously, the most expensive gold card being, being Killian Mbappe. So we just want to see the vibes with this card, man. We're going to play some draft games. And hopefully, we win the draft with Neymar leading as our striker. All right, here we go with our first uh, game, y'all boys, with Neymar. Let's see the type of team he has. Best in the world. Interesting team name. Um, and he has Oblak, Rudiger. Dinatale. Dinatale is pretty good this year, guys, by the way. If you guys need, like, a meta attacker, I highly recommend you guys buy him. Ooh, unlucky there, but that was a pretty good setup. Yeah, left stick is pretty dead this year in FIFA, I'm not going to lie. Nice, good finish right there to lead the game. We do take that. A shot we do take the rebound goal right there oh never mind he was offside damn all right guys i don't know what happened but this guy that we were playing against he left the game or he got kicked off the servers but we do take the 2-1 win obviously namor scored a goal this game so we're going straight into the second game oh that is a ball that is a ball that is a finish as well we do take that leading up the second game Neymar, oof, unlucky. Neymar, can he finish? Oh my goodness, what am I seeing? Trying to left stick as much as possible right there. As you guys see, the left stick is very slow this year for people 23. I don't like that. Hopefully they bump up the speed of the left stick dribbling, but that was a clean finish. Outside the foot shot trade. I like the outside the foot shot trade shot animation you get this year. Like, it's different from the past FIFAs. But for the most part, when you shoot it and you get the activation, it goes in most of the time. So I do like it. That's a great run right there from Neymar. He's making some great runs this game. Unlucky with the shot right there. Ooh, good try right there. Good try, good try. Nice reverse elastical right there. Nice reverse elastical animation. I'm surprised we got that speed boost plus uh, past the center back, but we do take that. Nice heel to heel. Borrow. Oof. Unlucky with the physicality right there. You know, Neymar always weak every year, so that was a little tough right there. Ooh. Great run. Chip shot. You got to be kidding me. How does that not go in, man? Unlucky. We do take that. We do take that cheeky tap in, winning this game 6-4. Neymar had a great game, by the way. A couple shots and chances that he missed, but we do take the win and the goals that he scored. So we're going straight into the third game. Good find right there. I'm telling you guys, the left stick is non-existent in FIFA 23. Shit is very hard to left stick in this game. Neymar, one time finish, nice and easy in the box. We do take that. Nice cut right there. Should be an easy finish, four to one. We do take that. He has great attacking positioning, making some great runs these games. There you go, Neymar. Too easy, too easy for the card. Way too easy, and it's probably gonna be a rage quid. So good stuff from the card. Um, Try to see, so three goals and assists this game. Absolutely phenomenal game. We're going to the final of the draft. Hopefully we can win it right now. Great find right there. So we can do with Neymar. Probably gonna take the shot with him. Unlucky there, unlucky. Ooh, what a find. 
What a fine and what a finish. Great composure. That was nice. Good play right there. Great ball right there. Fake shots. Nice assist from Neymar right there. Great ball right there. Unfortunately, we couldn't score, but that was a great pass, you know, with that animation. Oh, that was nice. We got a little bit of some, you know, some Neymar highlights. Nice, fine right there from Neymar. Great chance created. We're extra time right now. A very sweaty game, but hopefully we can clutch it up. Nice. And we ended up winning the game 5-3. to three. Um, We won the draft, guys. We won the draft. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and give you guys my verdict on Neymar right now. So, guys, 89 Neymar. We played four games with him. We had 11 goals. We had three assists. Um, great return from the card considering we were playing draft. Gameplay was very slow. We were getting a lot of lag spikes and speed up lags in game. But Neymar delivered and we won the draft. So, Pros of the card, obviously, is the attack positioning. Very, very solid. Uh, finishing was actually better than I expected. Usually, gold Neymar's finishing is kind of an issue. I wouldn't say it's, you know, it's it's crazy, like CR7's finishing, but it's actually better than I expected. Um, it's funny because usually another pro, I would say, would be the dribbling, but I can't even name that as a pro, guys, because as you guys know, the the gameplay is absolutely dog shit this year as far as left stick dribbling skill moves in general it's very slow it's very clunky so i can't even name that as a pro it's crazy that somebody like neymar you can't even notice the dribbling from like an average gold card it's actually insane um physicality obviously it's always going to be a con for neymar he does get body off the ball really easily if you just bring any defender on him but for the most part, guys, he does offer great links. Um, a very, very solid card. He's probably top two in the game. Top two gold card along with Kylian Mbappe. Uh, I've tried Kylian Mbappe only once. Can't really give a review off that because it's only it was only one or two games. But Neymar, Neymar is definitely a high-end top-tier card. Typical Neymar from every single FIFA. So I highly recommend you guys buy him. Obviously usable at this stage of the game. Uh, rating wise, hmm. Rating wise is tough because the gameplay is very slow and clunky. So Neymar is not exactly Neymar like how he was the past FIFA's, considering the pace downgrade. But he's obviously still a top two gold card in the game. So I'm gonna have to give him a nine out of ten, guys. I still think Neymar is that guy, especially if you play him at striker. I still think he's very, very good, in my personal opinion. So I would give him a nine out of ten rating. One of the best cards I've used this year. Probably the best attacker I've used this year. Not including any icons. But yeah, guys. That is my player review for Neymar, guys. Let me know in the comment section down below if you guys tried out this card. If you guys enjoyed him. Or what did you guys think of him? Also, guys, did you guys enjoy the FIFA 23 gameplay so far? For me, it's very slow. As somebody that's competed past FIFA, this is probably the slowest FIFA that I've played, honestly. So... Honestly, hopefully they buff up the speed a little bit. I like the defense a lot, but the offense could be could use a little bit of work. So thank you guys so much for supporting all these videos. Um, if you guys are new and enjoying the content, feel free to drop a subscription. And I hope you guys all have a beautiful day or night wherever you're at. God bless. It's been your boy Dan FIFA, and I'm out. Peace.